Hey, this is Ben with GI. Hey, it's Tom down in the ER. I've got a patient for you. Okay, what's up? Looks like he's got acute liver failure. What? Yeah. Okay, hold on. Let me get some information. What's his INR? Uh, still waiting on the INR, but ALT and AST are in the hundreds. Wait, what? Billy Rubin is 10. Okay, do we have any collateral history from family members? No, he came in alone. Says he was drinking a lot of alcohol and then he started having belly pain. So he's talking? Oh yeah, he's got a lot to say. So he's not altered. He's a bit of a kook, but he's fine otherwise. So this isn't really acute liver failure then? Look doc, you're the expert. I don't have time to learn the inner terminology of every specialty. Sure, that's fair, but acute liver failure is an emergency. Seems pretty concerning to me. All his numbers were normal a few weeks ago. But acute liver failure is very specifically defined as acute liver injury with elevated INR and altered mental status. Okay. And it means we need to consider an emergent liver transplant. So it raises the heart rate of a GI fellow when you say that. I'll keep that in mind next time. It would be like if I called you for a level one trauma that wasn't really a severe trauma. That actually happens fairly often. Okay, well, uh, like if a doctor sends a patient to the ER from clinic, even though it's not technically an emergency, it's just, uh... Just what? Uh, you know what? Call whenever you need and use whatever words you'd like. Sorry, I'll be down in a bit. Great, thanks.